The Witcher's contact in Velen was to be Hendrik, the Emperor's spy. Hendrik was operating incognito in that war-ravaged land. His mission, to gather intelligence about Ciri. We were starved long past. Huh? What do you want? Hear about the notice. Got monster trouble? Trouble? <laughs> Good one. We're not having trouble. We're up shit fucking creek. Some shaggy fuck knows what sitting in the woods attacking every plowman transport that dares take the high road. We need out of bolts, arrows, rations. All around, fucked. Sent a patrol out. Looks never came back. So the job's simple. Bring me the fucker's head, and I'll give you gold. As much as the notice says. I'm not gonna haggle. Quartermaster won't budge. But I can throw in a pass that'll get you to cross the pontar. So, deal? Sounds fair. See what I can do. Watch your step. Oh. I'm gonna try some goose oh. spot. It's supposed to taste like big witch. It used to be wagon showed on market days, loaded with all kinds of fat, smoked bacon, lard.
Come on. Look like claw marks, but here, an arrow. Shaft's broken off right at the skin. Looted bear. Either someone stole the cargo after the monster attack, or our monster collects military paraphernalia. Clawed and gnawed. Necrophage is fed here, but all the wounds they inflicted are post-mortem. And nod. Necrophage is fed here, but all the wounds they inflicted are post mortem. Footprints. A survivor? Either that or the monster's a humanoid. Something's fishy here. I should follow these tracks. some. One step more, and you'll gain a new hole in your head, Dwan. What do you seek here? Speak! Set your weapon aside. You've killed enough humans already. No. No, I have not. At least one more must die. Edme! Lost your nerve? Mm. 
Let's go. Back finally. Did you get the beast? No beast to speak of in the woods. Just elves from a square tail band that attacked the convoys. Here, they're squirrel tails. Squirrel tail, you say? Mm. And I thought we'd exterminated the last of those vermin. And the non humans left and wised up. Well, seems we'll need to pacify them again. Make a list of all the long ears around, and hang every tenth one. That should do it. Yeah, definitely. I see we're of a mind on this. You're a good man. Here, the gold I promised you, and the pass. Good luck. You start to ask the pallet for help? Oh, it's a goose. Go, go. Out. I'm not gonna hurt you. When did you last eat? A week back. Half a charred squirrel and a handful of berries. Here. Be sure to share it with the others. Thank you. Here, for you. For your kindness.
Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. What do you want with him? Wanna talk to him. What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. Got company. Who is it? Incape, Vorka. Who's this? Un? Brave warrior, looks like. Got two swords, see? Oi, great boy. What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers, too. You fucking death. Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? I'm a witcher. Heard you wondering about my swords. Well, one's for monsters, the other for humans. Only got one prick, though, in case you're wondering about that, too. Don't touch him. Don't even look at him. Worse than lepers, that lot. Saw one in action once. Killed a half dozen. Blood everywhere. Freak didn't even show a drop of sweat. Got the stench of corpses on him. If you want a rest, come with me. Or the bench you can use. I step in the hood, and there's the bumpkin with what looks like his son. That's on the pretty side, I think to myself. I see he'd probably disguised his daughter. <laughs> Corson's always managed that. Thanks for not starting a row with those swine. I don't generally poke my nose in other people's business. Looking to stay the night? No. Hmm. I'm looking for Hendrik. Man lives in Heatherton. Don't know where that is. Other side of the hill. 
Looked that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. But who knows? Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap of bread. Baron's men don't like strangers. Aye, he stays out of their way. Always seems to know when they're coming. Always manages to disappear. Thanks, Inkeep. strange, like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day, and the mist. Whoever you is, get away! Calm down. It's over. Aye, it's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream, how he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see, and the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange, the toads, I cannot hear them. through and through. Hendrik screamed. Then he begged. 
By the end, he could do naught but moan. here long, the terrors. Yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. You in that hut when they rode off? No. And I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. Great. Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Should check his boots. Blood congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. left unlocked on display almost lost his mind or hmm. Hmm. interesting Ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrick was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talk to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp. Encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. 
ill omen peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Ciri, thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. Come on, Roach. An old feeble woman. What's wrong? To their night blasphemers, pox taken, profane the shrine to Verna the Merciful. Shrine's gotta be repaired, else Verna will take umbrage. Her cows will croak, kitties will be covered in warts, and our dogs will get the mange. Warts and mange? Sounds dangerous. Fine, I'll help you. have sent ye to me. Someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher. Restoring traditional roadside structures in wood? Just not my specialty. Fight evil. That's a witcher's calling. And vandals are worse than beasts. Fine. I see any damaged shrines. I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way, though. Nothing's out of the way in these parts. And the gods will guide ye. Turn this one pale.
roots are gonna rot my gut. Rain don't rust your blades. Gonna try God to bless you. Which I did indeed. Didn't ask much for it either. Maybe we should pay her a visit. How'd you get there? Half past the pond. Follow it till you reach a lone rock. Round that, and head right off the path into the woods. And keep straight. You know you've gone the right way when you pass an abandoned cart. Ought to be able to find the witch now. somewhere nearby. Miss, cows are wheezing, won't rise from the barn floor. Pus streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, miss, but you know things. Tis our last cow. None other left in the village. Rest died of hunger. Or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn. Thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. She's in a foul mood. We'd best come back on the morrow. Watch what you say. She's quick to iron, apt to take revenge. Come on home. Now, where's she run off to? Pentagram in chalk. Hmm. Managed to amass quite a book collection. And see bubbles like this in Velen. Looks like rain.
ordinary ointment. Nothing special. Valara must be some artifact or so this is where she disappeared to Take you, Geralt. I'm upstairs. Don't be shy. Greetings, Witcher. Mr. Spot. Where? Hope you didn't come to court. No. To talk. Turn around and wait. Deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Fultest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. Mm, someone's grown irritable. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. Now tell me what brings you here. So, bet you saw this question coming. What are you doing here? Let me think. Enjoying the country air? Admiring the unspoilt scenery? Or is it furthering the age-old alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No. I'm in hiding, Geralt. Blind to the state of the world? Don't you see what's happening? You mean the persecution mages now face? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? Murderers scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. picked a strange place to hide. I didn't pick anything. In the north, Radovid's men hunt sorceresses like fish in a barrel. Nilfgaard controls the south. Where was I to flee? Emperor does keep mages on a short leash, but he lets them live and ply their trade. Radovid and Emma differ in every respect except one. They share a deep hatred of the Lodge of Sorceresses. And I was a member. So how's it feel to be the village witch? <sighs> Horrid. 
No joy in having the boundless respect and trust of the local peasantry? <laughs> They'd respect anyone who could produce hemorrhoid cream. Been here a while, haven't you? Long enough for rot to set in. You cannot possibly imagine how much I detest this place. Changing the subject. Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much about one another these days. It's safer that way. Even tried to contact one another? I've wanted to many times. But I've no way of knowing who would answer. Or who might be listening. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh, really? Who? I'm looking for Siri. That Siri. And no one can know, understand? Cyrilla is here. The girl once sought by the Lodge of Sorceresses, and practically every ruler on the continent has landed here in Velen, and I know nothing of it. What is she doing here? Indications are she's hiding from someone. I heard she quarreled with a witch, but if you don't know anything... Sure you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. My undying gratitude. Good enough. It's nothing to sneeze at, but you've a knack for getting into trouble. I should probably ask for something more immediately deliverable. Oh, sod it, don't give me that look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. No flea-bitten Scoyotel slob either, but an elven mage. What was an elven mage doing in Velen? Well, I tried to ask him, of course, about everything. Of course. Oh, but you know how elves are. He asked many more questions than he answered. He say what his name was? He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. He was intelligent and composed. He say what he wanted with Siri? Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. He leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins near the village of Midpops. I'll go there with you. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I've unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, that she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. Let's go then. Yes, let's. Been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised or else his waif would appear. At any rate, I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Come on! Gvela Glan. The Wild Hunt. What? Phantom Riders? That means... I, I thought they didn't exist. Feast your eyes on the non-existent then. Hmm. Got a navigator with them. Uh, what? Can you teleport us to the other side? I'd rather teleport us home. Do you really mean to follow them? Teleport. Hurry up. 
Not sure I like any of this. Kira.
Kira. Afraid of rats? Could have annihilated them with one spell. Fine, won't say anything. So what happened to you? There's something here. Something that distorts teleportation. I've no idea how they managed to get to the other side problem free. Wild Hunt's teleportation magic is different. Got specially trained mages for that. Navigators, they call them. They can have three helmsmen and a parrot for all I care. I'll not risk that again. Let's go. Wild Hunt got a good head start on us, but we still stand a chance. Have you gone completely mad? We must leave here at once. I gotta know what the Wild Hunt's doing here. But we came to find the Elven Mage, not fight the Hunt. If they reach him first, we won't get a chance to talk to him. Besides... Go on. Finish. Wait. You've got some special interest in the Hunt. Is this about Siri? There's something you've not told me, isn't there? Come with me and maybe I will. Are you always like this? I'm beginning to feel sorry for Triss and Yen. Oh, very well. Let's go. Gavella Glan. That's him. That's the elf. All right, far, lady. What was that? An illusion? No, a morphotic projection. A what projection? Something akin to a post box for mages. Much safer than an ordinary letter, which anyone can intercept en route to its recipient. The message was definitely for Ciri, daughter of the Gull, Lara Doran's heir. Indeed. It is what the elves would title Ciri. But what was the bit about the sign of her sword? A riddle? Yeah, not a hard one, though. Not if you know Ciri named her sword Tireo. Swallow. Come now. Who aside from you would know that? Might have been the point. Your elven mage secured the passage, hid it, so that only Ciri could find it. He failed to foresee that someone like you would show up. Nevertheless, I think he was expecting uninvited guests. Made some preparations. Let's hope the Wild Hunt ran into some obstacles. Well then, let's go. Do you think following the Swallows will suffice? We'll see.
An old elven port. Must have been how they got here by sea. I wonder how long ago that was. Careful. That oily yellow vapor, it's toxic. I hardly need instruction from you. I recognized the Volpine Morel immediately. Vesemir told me that soon after he learned to cast Igni, he tried it out on the of mushrooms. Terrible idea. What happened? Well, he survived. The wounds heal off the cliff of the witchers. Come on. An old elven port. Must have been how they got here by sea. I wonder how long ago that was. Careful. That oily yellow vapor, it's toxic. I hardly need instruction from you. I recognize the Volpine Morel immediately. Vesemir told me that soon after he'd learned to cast Igni, he out on a patch of these mushrooms. Terrible idea. What happened? Well, he survived. And wounds heal awfully quick on young witchers. Come on. Follow. Seems we're headed the right way. the pillar with the projection. Sven, 
before the soul ascend in Sirel, before the soul ascend in Hazel Kelpie. Kelpie? Does he mean that sea monster? No, that's what Siri named her mare. Horse could apparently gallop like a demon. Hmm, <laughs> good name for a horse. So, shall we look for it? Gavella Glan. The sooner we can leave, the better. I wonder what all this means. They look hastily Hunting dog. On with lines. Can't see any connection to Kelpie. Must you touch everything? Geralt, are you all right? You might say so. A sea monster. Looks a bit like a Karen. Barrett, what the hell is that? Another security measure. Damn it all. A certain Doppler took a shot at impersonating me. Yes? And? He hated being me. Felt uncomfortable. Dopplers are kind-hearted by nature. <sighs> Drawing of a horse. Clue for Siri. Must be. Teleportation. This very portal. And I know why I landed in that drowner nest. You should be pleased to emerge from the portal in one piece. And everyone still wonders why I hate to be teleported. We must try to activate it. I think that's a swallow. It worked. Come. Sure, it's safe. Of course. Gavella Glan. It's grown awfully quiet. Is that bad? A bit like the calm before a storm.
I have a bad feeling about this. Tyrion are not recognized. Intruder, destroy the intruder. Intuition's a fine instrument, Witcher. Don't underestimate it. I've some very good feelings about you, for instance. In several domains. Once you finally find Siri, what will you do? Any plans? Depends what she wants. Imagined it. How it will transpire. What will she say? What will she look like? No. I'm sorry for getting ahead of myself. Tell us what over there. We must activate it quickly. I have a feeling another golem's about to surprise us. Managed to cross the bridge. This is where we saw the wild hunt. Great, means they're way ahead of us. Come on. Gavella Glan. Wild hunt, definitely. They destroyed the major sentries. They did come here for a friendly chat with the elf. Meaning you ever thought they might have? Frozen before they could attack.
Kira. What's wrong? It'll pass. That took a great deal of power. If you can't go on... You can't leave me here. I'd never do that. <clears throat> Love to be able to say we could stay here a while and rest. I know. I know. We must go on. Uh, they blocked the passage. Maybe I can try. Leave it to me. without me, would you? Come now, admit it. He awaits us. Stubborn Dwan. Geralt, I, I shall help you. Step back. Stop telling me what to do. I wonder how long you will last. Come <laughs> on. 
necessarily. Let's look around. If I have my knickers on straight, this looks like the elves' laboratory. Look, the elf has... La Rena Luna. All right, let's watch this message. Sirel, this place is no longer safe. Do not tarry here long. Trust no one. And above all, beware the witches of Crookback Bog. Try to reach the place where last we were together. Where last we were together? Not much to go on. Damn it. Perhaps it's best he didn't leave a clearer message. The Wild Hunt broke in here. Surely they saw the projection. They searched everything. And if they had more time, they'd probably have torn the place to the ground. But that doesn't change the fact that we haven't learned anything. Not about the Elf, not about Ciri. Well, we know they were well acquainted, and traveling together. Wonder why they split up. Perhaps because the Wild Hunt was on the Elf's trail, and Ciri would be safer if they did. The witches of Crookback Swamp. Crookback Bog. Kira, if you're hiding something. But I didn't say. Why didn't you say anything earlier? I told you Siri had a run in with a witch. Well, I had no idea you meant then. If I'd told you something, you would have rushed off to find them. But we needed first to confirm that Siri was here, didn't we? I shall tell you everything now, of course. Now? After I safely led you through the cave? I can't believe you'd think so poorly of me. Perhaps you do bear a grudge against sorceresses. Mm-hmm. Can't imagine where that comes from. You know these witches? I've never met them, but I've read of them. In an old manuscript I found in one of the huts in the village. It mentions the village witches venturing into Crookback Bog at times, to liaise between the villagers and the crones, the ladies of the wood. The crones appear to be intolerant of outsiders, but they help the local folk. Apparently, they stop the spread of the plague in Bellum. Hmm. What's your take on this? I'd love to shrug it off as the nattering of so many old women, yet throughout my first fortnight in Bellum, I had horrible nightmares. Something was calling me out into the swamps. One night, I decided to enter the dream consciously. Render it lucid. I confronted the thing directly. It broke contact at once. Peaceful nights ever since. How do I find them? The swamps are vast. Dangerous. But they say the crones mark the way for peasants who wish to visit them. The manuscript mentions a chapel in Crookback Bog. And from that chapel, one must follow a trail of treats. Treats? Of course. They didn't read you bedtime stories at Care Morhen. All normal folk know that witches live in gingerbread houses poised atop chicken legs. I'll have to see that to believe it. Take the tome and read it. I... I truly do believe you'll find your Cirilla. All right then. As a start, let's look for a way out of here. Good idea. Why do we even come? Hmm. Mysterious mage herbalist. What's this? The potion I gave him. Seems he saw a use for it. Drank it.
must have burned these notes himself, the hunt wouldn't have bothered. Meaning he knew they were looking for him. Strange. My medallion's trembling, but there's nothing here. What's with this wall? It's an illusion. I sensed it as well. I expected we might run into such things, so I brought this. Meaning what? The Eye of Nahalani. It dispels illusions. It's easy enough to build, so you're welcome to this one. It's bound to come in handy. And each time it does, you will think of me. Huh. Thanks. Simple, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Let's see where the passage leads. Do you feel that? A flow of fresh air from the left must be an exit that way. Good. Let's get out of here. Wait, there's still the magic lamp. The magic what now? Lamp. The elf promised it to me in exchange for my help. And since his return here seems doubtful, I must retrieve it myself. If I can find it, that is. Will you help? Yeah, I'll help. Splendid. Come then. Gavella Glan. Like another damned riddle to me. Inscription here. Show me. Can you translate the inscription? I can decipher maybe a third, but that third doesn't make much sense. Give me a minute. I was never any good at the high variant of the Elder Speech. Hmm. <clears throat> All right. This might seem a bit literal. I'm afraid I can't replicate its sophisticated internal rhymes. Just translate it to make sense. Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first to light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, by the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet, like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. Hmm. Sounds like a riddle, all right. All right. Let's see if we can solve this. Wait. 
Something just happened. Mm -hmm. Behind that wall, a movement. Let's try it. Just gotta figure out the order. Four statues, each like the other. What? This grave, is it? What do you think? No inscription, sadly. Sign of the gull. If I didn't already know where she was buried, I guess this is Laura Doran's sepulcher. Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. Heroine of a tragic legend to some, but most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Kragenin of Laud. Perhaps the elven mage is Lara's kin. It would explain why he's helping Ciri. Possible. This what you're looking for? Uh-huh. So what's it supposed to do? Hmm. I hope I'll be able to activate it. Let's leave this place, shall we? Worth it, right? You learned something about Siri in the end. Something important. Do you intend to venture into Crookback Bog? You must tell me about it afterwards. Don't know that I'll get the chance. Geralt, there are two types of men. Those who see opportunity and take advantage, and those who forge the opportunities themselves. I've always seen you as an example of the latter. Besides, I've a favor to ask you. So, visit me sometime? I'll stop by. You can be sure. In that case, I shall be waiting. See ya, Kira. <laughs> <laughs> 